Hey everybody, I guess you guys can tell what the this video is going to be about. This video, um, it's a, this one of my viewers, she asked me if um, there's any other type of traps she could get because those traps I showed, you know, the body grip and the foothold, they scare her. And like I told her, those bigger, those 220s and 330s, they scare me. But I told her, you know, I'd do a video for her. This is a uh, live catch trap. It's a, it's a big one. It's for, like, um, raccoons and possums and groundhogs, you know. Uh, I got this at Tractor Supply, and it came with two. It came with this one and a smaller one for, like, rabbits and squirrels. And uh, it was, like, $25.00 as having a sale so I picked up a few of them and I've used them you know I use it quite a bit but um, you know this would probably be easier for her to set up and use then if you catch something all you got to do is take a 22 and just stick it down in there and pull the trigger and it's a quick way quick quick kill but you know it's it's simple setup you know it's got a safety latch here for your door but you just bring it up See if I can set it one hand here. Let me remove the safety latch. And there you go. It's set. Because that's your... I'm trying to get over here, guys, so you can see it. Um, well, crap. I can't get in there. There it is. But you want that set, and I got it set light. For a light touch. And what they do, you know, they come in here, they come through, and... Usually, <coughs> excuse me, guys. I have a um, a container like this, but the, I cut the top off a little bit, and I've got two holes back here, and I have it inside the cage. And you can see my wire down there, but I, I wire it kind of up a little bit. That way, they can't get in there, and um, you know, I just cut it enough where they can get the smell. And they can't reach through here and put their hands, you know, through here to get the get the bait. So, like I said, I just cut about. Well, let me get a stick and I can show you guys. There we go. You know, I just cut about that much off, just enough where they can get the smells out there, and they can't pop. Then I'll put a piece of tape around there. Then on the back. I'll have two holes where I can put a piece of tie wire and I'll tie wire it down here so they can't move it. And when they come through, you know, when they come through to get in there, they touch this, they touch the panel and they're in there. There's no way of getting out. But, um, you know, I believe this would be, you know, best for her to, um, to handle because like she said she's kind of afraid of the traps that I was showing and they will they will bite you and believe me they hurt when they bite but this like I said this right here it's a it's a um, you know live trap but if you catch one and you don't want it to don't want to release it just stick a 22 down in there a pistol or a rifle whatever pull the trigger and you know they die in the cage then you can skin them out eat them and it's uh it's convenience you know you can set this up anywhere you just got to be careful if you got a lot of cats around your house or something like that they love getting in these things i've set these things out in the woods and come back the next day and i'd have cats in here you know wild cats where i guess where people's turned them loose and i didn't know and um kind of shake them out and they go their way but I hope this video helped her and anybody else out there who um, who's new to trapping. You know, this is the beginner stage of trapping right here. Then you can always advance up to like the body grips and to the um, footholds and everything. Now, if you're going to trap, you guys need to, if you're going to do it for a hobby or means of um, making money, with this you need to get your um trapping license and you need to learn the regulations on trapping in your area 
Now, if it's a SHTF, it's a survival, there's no regulations, there's no rules. You're, you're in it just to get the food. But if you're going to do it, like for a hobby or something like that, always make sure you follow the guidelines and the, the, the rules of trapping. Make sure you're using the right traps, the right setups, and you have your trapping license. Here in Tennessee, trapping license are $34. And, um, let's see, coyote, groundhog, skunk, beaver, and something else. They're, it's opened all year round. But the 24th of October till, I think, February, the, um, regular trapping seasons for like um, coons and muskrats and mink and you know stuff like that's it's opened but um that's what i got for you i hope the lady who asked about it i hope that um helped her like i said i got these at tractor supply and they had a special on there you know you it was $25 and you get two. You get this size one and you get a smaller one for like squirrels and rabbits. And it's the same setup, it's just smaller. But I hope it helped. And um, anybody's got any questions, just feel free to ask me. Until the next one, guys. Bye.